So any physical theory, you trace it back to some final theory, some ultimate theory, however far back you want to go in the creation of the universe to the cosmic foam erupting in, in universes, that something comes out of that nothing. Well, that's not a nothing. That cosmic foam has laws, it has particles, antiparticles, law, uh, forces, all different kinds of things in that kind of nothing. You have to ask why there was that something. So at the end of the day, after we have either a final theory or a series of final theories or, or multiple universes with different theories in every one, at the end of the day, we still have that question, why is there something existing rather than nothing? I think that's right. I don't think it would be possible to say, for example, quantum physics tells us that it's likely that a blank would uh, fluctuate into a real world, and that's your final answer, because the question would be, why does this quantum physics apply to reality? And it's not enough to say the quantum physics tells us that it's probably going to apply to reality, because <laughs> the basic question is, why would that set of quantum physical laws be right.